So let's solve this problem. So to find the area under the standard normal distribution curve, then for this given to find the area between z equals 0 and z equals positive 1.07, then in a normal curve, so this is z equals 0, then we assume this is positive 1.07. And to find this area between 0 and positive 1.07, since the area for z equals 0 is 0, and to find the area for this 1.07 using this table, the z table, and take note that for this table, the area is between the mean and the z standard deviation so the mean is the center of the curve so to find now the area for this 1.07 so we have 1.0 then 0 0.07 so that's 1.07 then you connect to find the area so this is now the area for 1.07 so the area between 0 and 1.07 is 0 0.3577 then for this given to find the area between 0 and negative 2.36 so in a normal curve this is z equals 0 then we assume this is negative 2.36 then to find the area between 0 and negative 2.36 so since the area for z equals 0 is 0 and the area for negative 2.36 so using this table we need to ignore the negative so we have 2.36 so just ignore the negative so 2.3 then 0 0.06 that's 2.36 then you connect to find the area for 2.36 and that's equal to 0 0.4909 so the area between 0 and negative 2.36 is 0 0.4909 then for this given to find the area between 0 0.53 and 2.12 so in a normal curve we assume this is positive 53 and this is positive 2.12 so first we need to find the area for z equals 0 0.53 since this is the mean and the area for 0 0.53, so 0 0.5, then 0 0.03, that's 0 0.53, then you connect, so the area is 0 0.2019, so this area is 0 0.2019, then for the area, for z equals 2.12 so since from the mean and to find this area so we have 2.1 then 0 0.02 that's 2.12 then you connect to find the area so the area is 0 0.4830 since we're looking for the area between 0.53 and 2.12 so this is the unknown area and observe that this area is away from the mean so if the area is away from the mean so we need to subtract the two areas so we have the area equals the bigger area that's 0 0.4830 then minus the smaller area, 
that's 0 0.2019. So the area equals, so we have 0 0.4830 30 minus 0 0.2019 equals, so the area is 0 0.2811. Or in percentage form, this is equal to 28.11%. Then for is given, so the area between 0 0.72 and negative 1.44. So we assume this is positive 0.72 and we assume this is negative 1.44. Then to find the area for the 0 0.72 from the mean, so we have 0 0.7, then 0 0.02, that's 0 0.72. So the area is 0 0.2642. And for this negative 1.44, so just ignore the negative. So we have 1.4, then 0 0.04, that's 1.44. Then you connect to find the area. So that's 0 0.4251. Since between 0 0.72 and negative 1.44, and observe the area is with the mean since with the mean so we need to add the two areas so we have 0 0.4251 plus 0 0.2642 so the area is equal to 0 0.6893 in percentage form this is equal to 68.93% then for is given to find the area to the left of z equals negative 1.58. So we assume this is negative 1.58, no since to the left. So this is the unknown area. Then first, we need to find the area of negative 1.58. So since this is the mean, so this area for negative 1.58 then from this table so just ignore the negative so we have 1.5 then 0 0.08 so that's 1.58 then you connect to find the area so the area is 0 0.4429 so observe that the unknown area is away from the mean. So therefore, we need to subtract the two areas and to find the other area. Since the area of the curve is 1, so therefore, half of the curve, the area is 0 0.5. So to find now the area, so again, you subtract because the unknown area is away from the mean and this is the mean. So we have the bigger area minus the smaller area. So the area is 0 0.0571. Then in percentage form, this is 5.71%. Then for this area, so to the right of z equals negative 0 0.77. So we assume this is negative 0 0.77 since to the right. So this is the unknown area. But first, we need to find this area between the mean. So for negative, so just ignore the negative. So we have 0 0.7. Then 0 0.07, so that's 0 0.77. Then you connect, and the area is 0 0.2794. So observe that the unknown area is with the mean 
since with the mean, so therefore, we need to add the two areas and the other area, so half of the curve is 0 0.5. So we have area equals 0 0.5 plus, because with the mean, 0 0.2794. So the area is 0 0.7794, or this is 77.94%. Then for this even, so to the right of z equals 1.47. So we assume this is positive 1.47. So since to the right, so this is the unknown area. So, first, we need to find this area between the mean. So, we have 1.4, then 0 0.07, so that's 1.47. And to find the area, so that's 0 0.4292. Then, observe that the unknown area is away from the mean. So, we need to subtract the two areas and for the other area, so half of the curve is 0 0.5. So, to find now the area, so 0 0.5 minus 0 0.4292. So, the area to the right of 1.47 is 0 0.0708. Or in percentage, this is 7.08%.